Start by preheating the hot end and unloading filament. Using 6mm wrench supplied with the printer, unscrew and remove the nozzle. Turn the printer off and unplug the power cord. Let the machine cool down for at least 15 minutes. Using 2mm Allen wrench, unscrew nozzle cooling fan. Unscrew cooling block fan using 2mm wrench. With 1.5mm Allen wrench, loosen top and bottom set screws holding thermal tube. Carefully remove the hot end assembly from the extruder. Next, unscrew cooling block using 2mm Allen wrench. Now remove thermal tube from the heater block using 2mm Allen wrench. Next, install cooling block. One of the screws will interfere with thermal tube, so please use custom screw provided. Do not tighten cooling block yet. Make sure it still has some play in it. Insert all metal thermal tube into the cooling block. This will align cooling block. Using included Allen wrench, clamp the thermal tube. Now tighten three out of four cooling block screws. The fourth screw is not accessible yet. Unclamp and remove thermal tube. Tighten the last remaining cooling block screw. Test to make sure thermal tube slides in and out without interference. Install all metal thermal tube into heater block. Note the orientation of thermal tube. Flat side should face opposite of heater cartridge. Insert hot end assembly into the extruder. With 1.5 mm Allen wrench, tighten top set screw. Clamp the cooling block to tighten thermal tube. Next, install top cooling block fan. Install bottom nozzle cooling fan and shroud.
Install and hand tighten the nozzle. Plug the power cord back in and power up the machine. Preheat the extruder. Seat the nozzle. Don't over tighten it. Only slight pressure is required to properly seal it. Enjoy your all-metal hot end from Micro Swiss.